My research is in how to address erosion problems on unpaved roads throughout Kansas using a co-product called lignin, which is a waste product of biofuel production to stabilize roads throughout Kansas because 70% of Kansas roads are unpaved and erosion by wind and water is a major concern. Here's what the lignin looks like. It's a brownish gold powder. And what it does is it gives cohesion bonding between soil particles on a road surface to prevent them from washing away from rainfall or from vehicle traffic. I'm going to show you some plain dry granular sand which doesn't have any bonding mechanism between the sand particles and then when I add the lignin to that and then water you'll see the characteristics of that sand change dramatically. It'll be very viscous, it'll be almost like clay. And we're going to take our little mixing bowl. First we're going to put the sand in. You see it's just granular sand, very dry, nothing bonding the particles together. Then we're going to take the powdered lignin. Using my hands I'll mix it together. Right, now for the really interesting part, we're going to put the water in and you'll see how this powder and granular sand turns into a much more plastic material. I'll mold that into a sample. Voila! Here is what a sample looks like. And actually, I pre-prepared a sample for you guys. It's been drying in here for two days to let you guys see what the samples look like after they've dried for a period of time. Uh, sand lignin specimen hardens with time and becomes almost like rock. What I ha hope to gain from it is an understanding of what concentration of lignin optimizes the stabilization of the soil and also the increased bearing capacity of the soil, the amount of load that that soil can carry before it fails. So lignin is found in plant matter of all different types of plants from trees to crops and using lignin as a means for stabilizing unpaved roads is very practical and tangible for Kansas because in Hugoton, Kansas, they're actually building a large-scale biofuel plant where lignin will be the co-product from it and it would be a great source of lignin to use on rural roads.